do a walk around of this 1985 Tartan 34. It's going to be in beautiful condition. You can hear the engine running, start it right up. Lazy Jacks, double spreader rig, masthead. Very nice thing to have. And you can hear the engine running. Start it up immediately. Very quiet and smooth. Double Bimini's. Starting at the bow, the uh, double windlass arrangement, plow anchor, electric. I'm going to walk down the starboard side. Everything looks peachy around the mast. Double spreader rig. These boats are very popular in California as racing boats, racer cruisers, because they are strong. So I think if someone's looking to do some nice cruising, this would be a great boat to have. Yes, it is. No matter what they want, just to go out for mm -hmm. a few hours. Yeah, just go and noodle around or do some club racing, some beer cans. Come down into the cockpit. That's the interior. Looking forward. All the stoppers are arranged. You can pretty well do everything from the cockpit. Very sturdy looking traveler. Ample cockpit hatches. Wow, that's an enormous hatch. Nice big destroyer type wheel, life sling, hydraulic backstay, nice features, boarding ladder, barbecue, always a must have on a cruising boat. Nice helmsman seat. Engine controls are down here. And a GPS map 4210. Excellent condition. Okay. All of the canvas looks really good. down starboard is your galley area with sink ice box three burner stove and oven lots of storage space for dishes and what have you Hello, doors from utensils very serviceable little galley and to port we have a quarter berth, fairly large, and then the navigation station. That's all the instrumentation, VHF radio, and a stereo fold chart table. Now looking forward to port the settee. Lots of cupboards, same to starboard. As you can see, the overhead is totally clean. No signs of 
leakage or water intrusion anywhere. Bose speakers, fold down table. And going forward now to the forward compartment to port, you have a set of drawers and hanging lockers. The starboard is your head area with rings for a shower curtain, goes around. Pump head. hanging locker again. Set of drawers and cabinets. And a door that closes to give you privacy in the forward cabin. Once again, looking from the head backwards. Be some light splashing through the port lights, which might make the pictures a little hazy. And there is storage under both berths, and I believe this berth pulls out into a double. Lots of storage space on both sides. Great cruising boat, great for day sailing. It's got a four foot five draft with a little bald keel. Good for these waters. And would make a great cruising boat as well. You can do club racing on it. Still reads very well. Although it doesn't have racing gear, it's got a roller for early head sail. And you'd go in the non-spinnaker division. 